Okay, y'all, I'm editing, and Lord have mercy. There is all kind of stuff. I'm just talking and talking, talking, need to just hush. Stuff I said, it don't even matter. And then, oh my God, y'all, I just straight up lied about how many bags I do and don't have in my denim collection. Lord have mercy, face palm, face palm, face palm, face palm. Bear with me, y'all. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm gonna to show you guys what is in my Coach Gallery tote. This is the older model or the original model, however you wanna describe it. Um, this is in the dark brown signature color. I have the blinds open, I have the room lights on, I have the bedroom door open, and it's just super bright, y'all. I feel like unless I film in the middle of the day, um, <clears throat> That it's just, I don't know, I guess because the sun is like working its way to start going down. Um, it's just super bright. But on the viewfinder, it looks like it's pretty good. So I think we're good to go. Um, again, this is an older model, so it does have the zipper on the front. Um, I have some pretty charms here. I have my purple and gold, um, Layla purple with other purples <laughs> charm from Charm by Charmin. And then I have a coach, um, horse and carriage charm you guys i have so many charms sometimes i forget which ones i have or i don't see them and i haven't used this one in a while i also have it in silver and i hadn't used either one in a while so i decided to add it with the um charm and i thought it looked really good layered together and then of course the hang tag over there so that is the front this is the side this is the back the other side and then back to the front on the bottom it does not have feet it just has one big old booty and this is essentially a tote um i wouldn't say it's the exact size as a neverfull but essentially it can hold the same thing because it does have a similar type of booty this one just happens to have a zip top um and of course it's weatherproof like you don't have to worry about snow rain sleet mist nothing so i'm gonna show you guys what i have inside on the front pocket here i just have my phone just because i brought it upstairs um you know to come upstairs to my bedroom start getting some stuff done what in the world oh okay um and then this is kind of an overview or bird's eye view of course it's black in there so it's not super easy to see but this is how i have everything in there so i'll start with the back pocket to get it out of the way i have my um flat bottle from sheen with some hand sanitizer in it and i do have my little pink basket here right underneath the tripod i have my chapstick from um dollar tree and i could use some y'all so give me just a minute if you don't mind mm -hmm. okay then I have the tags in the bag. So if anybody was curious, this is what it looks like. I'm sure you probably could find these on that um, pre-love market. I don't know for sure. I haven't looked. I have my clipper from Amazon to hang my bag anywhere that I go. And then I have two pins. So I can't remember if I had this one in the last setup or not, but this is like a really pretty um, pinkish purple with rose gold hardware. It's a Villa Beautiful pen. Y'all know those are my faves. That is a gel. So I did add this pretty pen gem pen that I got around the holidays. Um, I got it in a three pack and I gifted the other two. I thought it was super cute. The other two pens, I thought they would be perfect for two of my friends. And I really wanted this one, but I didn't want the others. Well, it's not that I didn't want the others. It's just I kind of already had one similar to the others, but I thought this one was super cute. So, pin gym pin. This one is ballpoint. You know, sometimes you need to sign those receipts um, that are, you know, the kind of glossy material. Clipped onto that pocket as usual. I do have my taser, so I do have that. It's from Amazon. It's linked in my storefront. Then closest to, I don't know if I could tilt her any kind of way. We're going to try. It's not really going to work out. Yeah, it's not really going to work out. <laughs> Um, closest to that back pocket, I did have my little wallet. So this is the coach, um, Jesus, what's it called? Zip card case. I think this is the only one that I have in my collection right now. This is the dark signature one. I can't remember what bag or maybe it was on sale. I don't know you guys. I got it a while back. Just like this bag. I, this is a, or well, she was a new bag. I did pop the tags, but I got this a while back. I don't remember exactly what I was thinking when I got it. However, perfect match. So I do have my main cards in here. I have my um, VA ID on the back. And then in the zipper part, I just have all my other cards. So of course I can't really, you know, show you that because the cards are in there, but I just have all my other cards on the inside. And this was my one and only wallet. And then y'all know I like to keep the coins loose. I also picked this up last year around the same time that I got the bag. Maybe that's when I got the wallet. I don't remember. But in here, full of coins. So quite a few coins. And I might actually get some of these used this weekend when I run some errands. 
Next is my super large catch-all. So this is the Victoria's Secret um, clear PVC pouch with that gorgeous Layla purple kind of quilted woven type of pattern. I don't know what to call it, but super cute. I love it. My friend Akila makes charms sometimes and she made me this cute little charm. So I decided to put it on here since it matches perfectly with the silver hardware. So in here I have my lovely items, my essentials. So I have my mandatory essentials pouch. Y'all heard me say I'm getting kind of bored with the black lace pouch. It's spring. I want some colors. So found this one in my stash. I had ordered it from Sheen a while back. I wanted a smaller pouch. I think when I ordered it, I was planning to put like lip gloss and stuff in it, but it came in handy. I did go ahead and pull um, a lot of my smaller pouches out and kind of group them together in the drawer so that I can use them for my little, what I like to call mandatory catch-all. So in my mandatory catch-all, I have my re-wetting drops. I have a mesh pouch with a liner in it. I have one fingernail file. And you know what? I've been meaning. I have stuck my hand in here two or three times to get my power bank out. And thank God it wasn't with this set. But with the previous nail polish that I was wearing. And it scratched it, y'all. And I was pissed. So, yeah. I wanted to see if this would fit in here. This will fit in here. I'm just not sure it will fit in the black lace pouch. And that's my worry. Um, but I think I'm going to take this out and change it. So, yeah, we'll see. Um, anyway, so that's back in there. So then the rest of the items in here are my usual. So I have my purple power bank um, from Amazon. I have a smaller chapstick. I did pick up a couple of these from the Dollar Tree just because they take up less space than the larger one that I generally love. I have some breath strips, my one Q-tip, and then a piece of candy. So these are the essentials I need if I'm going to be on the go in a smaller bag, which is probably gonna be tomorrow after work. <laughs> it's gonna be that kind of scenario. Need to run some errands. Uh oh, more that little piece of candy. There we go. So yeah, I think I'm gonna try. I don't even know if they still sell those. Do they still sell these, y'all? They probably don't have purple anymore. But I need to look and see if I can get. Or maybe I don't need a second one of these. Like, am I losing my mind? I'm losing my mind, y'all. I really am. Why would I need a second one? I don't need a second one. I just need to put this one in here. Duh. Okay, got it together. All right, Fenty Beauty Lip Gloss. This is my current favorite. This is the Fenty Glow. I have my Fenty Beauty uh, Mattifying Powder. This one is a new one than the last one that you saw. That one hit pan, so I decided to um, take it out of my purse, put the brand one new here, and I have that one at work. So, uh, Mattifying Powder. You also can use it as a setting powder. I have not tried it yet, but I'm going to try it the next time I do a full face. I'm gonna try it as my setting powder instead of my loose setting powder and just see if I like it. But for mattifying my face when I'm wearing a full face of makeup, it works perfect. And my new routine, putting it on every couple hours throughout the day, um, just over my bare skin to keep myself mattified has been working. I love it. So if you have oily skin, you should try it. Um, this is the Strawberry Pound Cake hand cream from Bath & Body Works. I have my little pill case from Sheen with the little sticker on it. Inside I just have Pain Mage Vinegrill. Have my little tiny bottle from Sheen that I picked up to put some extra Tatcha face moisturizer in. I have a little purple comb. My hair has been straight lately. And let me tell y'all, my edges, that's why I'm not on camera. They all over the place right now. So I'm actually going to touch them up. Um, I made the mistake of going to sleep without my bonnet the other night. And without wrapping my hair. I'm pretty sure y'all already can picture <laughs> what I got going on over here. Um, this is the tiny little glitter pouch from Sheen. I just use it as my first aid kit and I also have an extra pair of contacts in there. I recently grabbed these from CVS because I wanted to try them out. This is the flat pack of tissues. So I do have that. I have a couple of coupons and I probably better check these out. Yeah, I need to make sure I'm going over there on Saturday. Okay, these two can't be used yet. Okay, so some coupons from Vicky's and um, what's that place called? Bath and Body Works. Then I have a ponytail holder and I think it's another one in here. I usually try to keep two because I'm really bad about putting it in my hair, wearing it in the house, and the next time I'm outside and I need one and I'm like, what the hell happened to my ponytail holder? Or my scrunchie or whatever you want to call it. It was in my damn catch-all and then I put it in my head and now it's in the house. Tiny little... um perfume bottle in case I want to add some freshness on the go. I have this little cute case from the Dollar Tree. I've just got some icebreaker mint in it. Then I have my purple nail file and she is empty. So this is the little catch-all pouch from Vicky's, completely empty. All the rubies are loose in there. And then in the corner I have my readers. These are from the Dollar Tree. Just some cute little purple readers in this cute little purple case that I got from my friend Maya E. Then I have my tiny little planner. You guys, let me tell you, I love how we inspire each other and just remind each other of things that we have in our stash that we can use. 
I had a pink um, personal rings planner and I had put a large L on the front when I first went to personal size. I guess it's probably about to be two years when we come into the fall. But anyway, long story short, me and my tripod sister, we were talking and she had added a, or was talking about adding a letter to the front of her new planner. Um, and I was like, oh my God, why haven't I added a letter to mine? I have several letters in the babe cave. So anywho, added a letter to the front. Absolutely love this cutie. However, lately I have been kind of annoyed that when I open her because of the big back pocket that I don't even use, she doesn't lay flat. So anytime I'm like flipping to a page, let me flip to something blank. Um, anytime I'm like flipping to a page, it's hard to do. Okay. Um, flipping to a page and I need to write something. I can't just like leave it on the bed, like open like this because eventually it will close itself. So I end up having to turn it over and face down for it to keep my place. Um, so long story short, I've been kind of looking at some other covers, which nobody else has a purple one. I want a purple one. So I don't know you guys. I've been kind of playing with some ideas but anywho mini planner on the go I just use that to keep up with appointments events things are actually scheduled um so that if I'm out the house I don't double book anything I don't put like my to-do list and bills and that kind of stuff in there I just put my scheduled events so I don't you know double book anything or I know what's going on if we're out the house I'm still using my classic happy planner for my monthly and weekly and then my personal rings for my goals finances keeping up with bags that I carry and all of that and then of course all of my lists shopping lists meal ideas um wish list things like that which I don't really have a wish list but y'all know what I mean anyway um sunglasses case in the dark signature as well I did cut the strap off if anybody's curious why you don't see anything hanging I don't like those I cut straps off practically everything I'm just not a strap kind of girl um so turn lock open it up it does still have my my infamous famous I was saying forever TJ Maxx and they're actually from Marshall so anyway the timber stores TMBR TJ Maxx Marshall's Burlington and Ross so sunglasses in there then I have this little cutie that comes does it come with that one or does it come with the other one no this comes with the three-piece set I was gonna say does it come with this one but no this one comes with the three-piece set y'all know about the whole set of course lay the purple give you here so anywho cute little um small half moon pouch using this as the lady pouch so in here i have my usual lady goodies i have a small pack of tissues for just the bathroom i have my little sheen pouch with my liners i have my other sheen pouch with some flossers and some q-tips a couple of lady wipes some soap sheets a couple of the expandable washcloths and then a tiny little spray bottle from sheen with some smell good in it should I need to freshen the bathroom up? Oops, get in there. All right, so I'm just gonna pack this back up because I don't want this stuff to be all over the basket. Catch all items are already all over the basket. I've been in this bag a couple days. I honestly think it's been like a whole week. The other night I wanted to switch, but then I ate dinner and got lazy. Y'all ever had that happen? Like you have so many plans, so many things you're gonna do and all of that, and you get dinner cooked for the family and everybody eats and you just got the itis. So that's what happened. But I'm gonna switch tonight. I got energy, so I'm gonna switch tonight. I just don't know to what. That's always my problem. Like everybody's sexy in my collection. Everybody, everybody's sexy. Everybody's over there screaming, me, 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 me. So I don't know. AirPods, I haven't done this in a while, but I wanted to use the purple on here. And Vicky Secrets recently came out with the one that's blue and I am obsessed with some of the denim collection pieces. I had one denim bag back in the day. It was a Michael Kors flap snap denim bag, but it was very structured. And I don't know y'all, it just started bothering me. I didn't like it. I sold it. So I have not had any denim bags in my collection in a while. And when I saw what was coming out, y'all listen, I got the, I got the strap. So anyway, back to putting my strap on my AirPods. If the bag is big enough, if I'm in a small bag, it's just going to be the AirPods and nothing else. Um, but if I'm in a larger bag, I will use this. So this one does have like green and teal and black in it but i of course am using it for the two purples because as you can see this is a layla purple setup i'm using my little karami pouch that i did get as my um in a gift from uh, maya e i just added a little um charm from sheen and in here i just put my candy so a couple candies i think it's a couple cough drops in the bottom and that is all that is in there and that is everything that is in the big part, y'all. She's completely empty. On the other side of the gallery, there is two slip pockets. So in one of them, I do have my, if you know, you know, six key holder from my IG friend. This one's in the Azure print and I have my keys and everything in here, plus my license and carry license and everything tucked in the back. Love, love, love this baby. Still working on stretching her out. 
Um, it's not as flexible <laughs> and it's easy to close as my leather one, but that's just because I've been using that leather one for like two years, y'all. Come on now. It's showing off for company. You haven't been this hard lately. A little hard, but not that hard. Where my house be? So anyway, got that closed. All right, and then that pocket's empty. In the other pocket, I just have my digital business card. So this one I use in public if I talk about bags or planners. Instagram, YouTube, um, QR code to get straight to my um, social media. I have a purple house key looking thing that's actually a knife. And then I have three charms. One with my mom and my sister, one with my tripod sisters, and then one with my Betsy. And I think that's everything, y'all. Yep. Yeah. So pockets are empty. The gallery is completely empty. This is a sexy bag, y'all. She really, really is sexy. I really love her. Um, I have three of them. I have every, uh, what do you call it? The signature print. <laughs> I have the dark. I have what I like to call the medium. It's the saddle, the brown one. Um, and then I also have the light khaki. And I love how, because it's such a nice, like it's busy, but it's like a, a, a neutral. So you can put whatever you want on the inside. So I really had fun going Layla. I feel like I do Layla purple, pink, and red like consistently. So I really want to branch out and do other setups, but at the same time, I'm like, but why? Like if it ain't broke, don't fix it. But I don't know you guys, I have so many SLGs. I really don't need to add like more colors, but we'll see, y'all know how that goes. We say what we don't need to do and then we turn around and do it anyway. So y'all, <laughs> y'all feel me. I know I am not alone, but if you don't have this bag and you think about getting it, um, you definitely should. Unfortunately, they did change the style. It is now shorter. And is it wider? I don't know. The shape is just different. It's definitely a different shape. I only have one of the newer shape. Um, in that iris purple, I call it Layla purple. I'll be honest, the shape is not my favorite. The color is my favorite, but I love this gallery shape much, much more than that one. So anywho, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. And if you're new here, hello and welcome. I will see everybody in the next video. Bye.